Kannada cinema, also known as Chandanavana, is the Indian film industry based in the state of Karnataka where motion pictures are produced in the Kannada language. The Kannada film industry sometimes metonymously referred to as sandalwood is the fifth largest film industry in India after Hindi cinema, Telugu cinema, Tamil cinema and Malayalam cinema by box office performance. As of 2017, the Kannada film industry based in the city of Bengaluru produces more than 190 films each year. Kannada films are released in more than 1250 single screen and multiplex theaters in Karnataka and most of them are also released across the country and in the United States, United Kingdom, Europe, UAE, Malaysia, Japan, China, Kenya, South Africa, Netherlands, Holland, Mexico, Pakistan, England, Russia, Germany, Brazil, Bangladesh, Nepal, Sri Lanka, Burma, Singapore, Australia and other countries. The first government institute in India to start technical courses related to films was established in 1941 named as Occupational Institute then called the Sri Jayashamarajendra Polytechnic in Bengaluru. In September 1996, two specialized courses, Cinematography and Sound and Television were separated and the Government Film and Television Institute was started at Hisaragata, under the World Bank Assisted Project for Technician Development in India. The industry is known for Kannada language literary works, being translated into motion pictures. Some of the works which received global acclaim include B. V. Karanth's Chomana Duty, Gurish Karnad's Kadu, Patabarama Reddy's Samskara, based on a novel by U. R. Ananthamurthy, which won Bronze Leopard at Locarno International Film Festival, and Gurish Kasaravali's Gadishrada, which won the Ducats Award at the Manham Film Festival Germany. Films such as Badara Kanapa, School Master, Sharapanyara, Bamshavruksha Budayana Maga Ayyu Gadishrada Kadu Kador Bara Ranganayaki Accident Pushpaka Vimana Tabarana Keita Khoria Thai Saheba A Main Dwipa Karia Film 2003, Munguru Mail, 2006, Sangoli Rayana, Film 2012, Dandupalya, 2012, Lucia, 2013, Mr. and Mrs. Ramachari, 2014, Rangitaranga, 2015, Uppi 2, 2015, Thithi, 2016, Kurik Party, 2016, Dodmain Hudga, 2016, Kodigoba 2, 2016, Shivalinga, 2016, Rajakumara, 2017, Tagaru, 2018, are considered landmark films in Kannada. Early history In 1934, the first Kannada Taki, Sati Sulachana, appeared in theatres, followed by Bhakta Dhruva aka Dhruva Kumar. Sati Sulachana was shot in Kolhapur at the Chhatrapathi studio. Most filming, sound recording, and post production was done in Chennai. In 1949, Hanapa Bhagavathar, who had earlier acted in Gubi Virana's films, produced Bhakta Kumbhara and starred in the lead role along with Pandaribai. In 1955, Bhagavathar again produced a Kannada film, Mahakavi Kalidasa, in which he introduced actress B. Saroja Devi. <laughs> Mainstream Rajkumar became famous during this period working solely in Kannada film industry. His wife Parvathama Rajkumar founded film production and distribution company, Vajreshwari Combines. Vamshavruksha, Prema Karanth's Faniyama, Kadu Kador, Hamsajithi, Accident, Akramana, Moru Darigalu, Tabarana Keita, Banada Vesha and Puttana Kanagal's Nagarahavu were released. Vishnuvardhan and Ambarish were the two stars born from the film Nagarahavu. Rajkumar and Vishnuvardhan are considered the two pillars of Kannada cinema. Shankar Nag was starred in works such as Andanandu Kaladali and Malgudi Days. Tiger Prabhakar, Anant Nag, Lokesh, Dwarakesh, Ashok, Srinath, M. P. Shankar, and Sundar Krishna Ors were the prominent actors who came in this period with Kalpana, Arathi, Lakshmi, Padma Vasanthi, Geetha, Madhavi, Saritha, Manjula and Jayamala being some of the actresses. 
The late 80s saw the emergence of V. Ravikandran and Shivaraj Kumar and Ramesh Arvind with works directed by Rajendra Singh Babu, D. Rajendra Babu, V. Somasakar, H. R. Bhargava, Sai Prakash, T. S. Nagabharana and M. S. Rajashikar. Directors Puttana Kanigal and Shankar Nag died. Bhavya, Mahalaksmi, Sudha Rani, Tara, Malashri, Anjali Sudhakar, Vanatha Vasu, Anjana, and Shruti were the notable actress of the era. At present actors like Darshan, Sudeep, Puneeth Rajkumar, Yash, Ganesh, Apendra, Vijay Raghavendra, Srimurali, Prajwal Devraj, Diganth, Rikshit Shetty, Prem, Shuran, Chiranjeevi Sarja, Dhruva Sarja, Donajaya are contributing themselves in Kannada industry. Heroines like Radhika Pandit, Ramya, Amulya, Pooja Gandhi, Andritha Ray, Rashmika Mandana, Ragini Dwivedi, Shanvi Srivastava, Rachita Ram, Shruti Haraharan, Deepa Saniti, Natha, Magana Raj, Manvitha Harish, Radhika Chetan, Pranitha Subhash, Avantika Shetty, Shraddha Srinath, Samyukta Hegde, Parul Yadav, Haripriya, Sanjana are made hit in Kannada cinema. Comedians like Chikana, Sadhu Kokila, Bullet Prakash, Kuri Prathap are very busy themselves in film shooting. Karnataka State Film Awards Udaya Film Awards Suvarna Film Awards Bangalore International Film Festival Other Awards Filmfare Awards South SIIMA Awards IIFA Utsavam Murchi Music Awards South Southscope Awards See also List of Kannada language films Media in Karnataka Cinema of India Media of India List of Kannada film actresses